What's going on, everybody? Welcome back in. The Arizona Cardinals are actually starting to make moves here on day two of free agency. Seems like we're starting to kind of kick the tires on this whole free agency, and we finally woke up. So we do got some news to kind of, you know, tell you guys to let you know how you guys are feeling. We've signed some former players of the Arizona Cardinals, and then we got a brand new piece as well. Before we get started, definitely do me a huge favor. Smack the like button on this video and subscribe for more Arizona Cardinals. Definitely don't be one of these guys that love to hover around this channel. Definitely subscribe it up. If you like this type of content, follow me on all my social platforms. Platforms, you'll be getting the news a lot faster that way. Just FYI, um, everything's going to be in the description of this video. But let's dive right into the players that we actually ended up retaining here for the Arizona Cardinals. Now, the report does come here from Bob McManaman. It says this, the Arizona Cardinals announced that they re-signed right tackle Kelvin Beecham. We all knew that, right? I, I think we all knew that. We posted it everywhere. Everything's good. Now, there is some new news coming out here saying that the Arizona Cardinals also signed Matt Prater to a two-year deal, as well as Corey Komet running back to a one-year deal. So former Arizona Cardinals are now starting to kind of come back here, um, you know, to play for the Arizona Cardinals at least for one more year. We knew the Kelvin Beecham for two years. Matt Prater seemed to be having another two-year contract and then running back Corey Komet as well, coming back to the Arizona Cardinals to play running back. So those are the news for former Arizona Cardinals. Let's move on over to the new addition, and that's going to be none other than Kazir White. Now the report came here from Jordan Schultz and it says this, breaking free agent linebacker Kazir White is signing a two-year, $11 million max deal with the Arizona Cardinals. Sources tell the score. Now, if you look at that contract, obviously about, if you do the math, $5.5 million per year, not very much, but it seems like the Arizona Cardinals are going after another linebacker. Now, I know how a lot of people feel, right? Linebacker, oh God, no. Uh, honestly, that was my first thought as well. I did a little digging into and who is Kazir White. It looks like he plays the weak side off the ball linebacker, uh, middle linebacker more than anything. So um, that's what it seems like the Arizona Cardinals are, are, are bringing him in for. Now, obviously, he spent some time with the uh, Philadelphia Eagles, but he originally got drafted over by the Los Angeles Chargers back in 2018. He was a fourth round pick, and right now he's still 26 years old, so he's still very, very young. So right after the Chargers being there from 2018 when he was drafted in 2021, he spent one year with the Philadelphia Eagles, and per the report of Jordan Schultz, it seems like he was a staple point within the Philadelphia Eagles defense. So, uh, you know, it's exciting, right? It, it's cool to see what's going to happen here with Kazir White. He's the first edition here of the Arizona Cardinals. So let's take a look to see what's going to happen. Now, if you take a look at his stats for the 2022 season in terms of like what ESPN shows, there's not very much like excitement going around. Now, granted, yes, 1.5 sacks, but if you are playing off the ball more than anything. You probably won't be getting a lot of opportunities for sacks, but he's got 66 solo tackles. I mean, that that's pretty cool, right? We definitely need to make sure that we have somebody that knows how to tackle. Uh, that's been an, also a kind of a thorn in our side in this last 2022 season where I felt like nobody knew how to tackle. So, I mean, if this guy can tackle, that's definitely a win here um, in my mind. Now, continue to talk about Kazir White. Obviously, we did mention here he's 26 years old, 6'2", 234 pounds, got drafted by the Chargers, and now he found himself over to to the Philadelphia Eagles makes sense, right? In terms of why he is coming to the Arizona Cardinals. And it's because of the connection, the connection between Jonathan Gannon, as well as Kazir White and Nick Rallies as well, our new defensive uh, coordinator for the Arizona Cardinals. So a lot of kind of moving pieces, a lot of connections kind of coming through. And it makes sense that the Arizona Cardinals were going to go after, you know, either one, two, multiple Philadelphia Eagle defensive players out there. So this is the new addition here of the Arizona Cardinals. Now, I also do want to mention the fact of being that if this guy is going to be an automatic starter for the Arizona Cardinals, playing that weak inside linebacking position, what's going to happen with Isaiah Simmons and Zayvon Collins? Because Zayvon Collins is the Mike linebacker and uh, Isaiah Simmons is usually the weak inside linebacker. So there might be a little bit of a discrepancy there, especially if Kazir White is going to start. So I'm excited to see how that's going to transpire. Are we going to be seeing something like a in Isaiah Simmons movement. Are we going to see something like that? Is this going to be more of a swing uh, type of, you know, kind of kind of swing by committee with Isaiah Simmons and Kazir White? So I'm excited to see how that's going to look like. Let me know if you guys know anything that I don't know. Let me know in the comments below. How are you feeling about the new addition of the Arizona Cardinals, Kazir White? All I got to say is welcome to the Bird Gang. He is signing a two-year deal worth about $5.5 million per year. Let me know, ladies and gentlemen, how you guys are feeling. Put it in the comments below. Appreciate you guys 
for tuning in. Have a great rest of your day. And as always, go Cards.